Welcome to this tutorial on how to create a custom trial balance and automap system for audit flow. Once you've downloaded the Excel template from the application, you will then be greeted with a set of instructions on the instructions tab. Working our way through these steps in this tutorial, firstly ensure that you have a copy of this saved centrally on either your server or local machine. Simply by going File, Save As, and saving to the appropriate location. Ensure that you provide an appropriate name and click save. Moving to step two, the first process which you will need to complete is actually setting up your custom chart of accounts for the auto map. We recommend that you obtain a copy of the full chart of accounts from the accounting system so that you can quickly and easily copy and paste this into the ch custom chart of accounts auto map tab. To do this, simply click on the custom chart of accounts auto map tab and you'll be greeted with a blank screen. Anywhere on screen where you see a blue area is where you can actually edit information. So to provide you with an example, we'll start adding in our account codes. Example 235, account description, and then setting out which folder you would like the account to be going to in audit flow. The lead schedule reference, lead schedule summary name, lead schedule reference and the lead schedule name. You'll also need to include the nature of the account being either an income statement item which will be shown as PL or as a balance sheet which you will display as BS. Repeat this process for all accounts or simply copy and paste your chart of accounts from your accounting package and then fill in the other areas on the screen. Once you've done this, you are then ready to move on and begin importing trial balances using your custom created chart of accounts auto map for audit flow. Returning to the instructions tab, the next step in the process to ensure you obtain a raw copy of the trial balance from the client being in either Excel or CSV format. If we open this trial balance up, at a minimum, please ensure that this has the account number, account name, and current year debits and credits. Simply select the trial balance area, ensuring that you do not use the Control plus A option. Press Control plus C to copy the trial balance. Return to your custom made auto map file and select the raw trial balance tab and paste onto cell A7 as per step four. You would then just need to go through a quick process of identifying which column is which on the trial balance. As you can see, we have our last year column here in A. So using the drop down option, we can then select for this to be the prior year debit and credit as a combined column. We then have our account code, account description, a quantity if applicable, current year debits, and current year credits. Moving back to our instructions, referring to step five, accessing the audit flow trial balance import sheet, you can now see that this has been fully populated with the trial balance, including all of the information about the folders, lead schedule summaries, and lead schedules which need to be imported. Now click file and save as, ensuring that we save this file as a CSV and appropriately naming this for import to audit flow. When warnings appear, simply click OK and Yes, and the file will be saved as a CSV file ready for import into audit flow. Accessing this trial balance, you can now see that the, only the audit flow import tab has been saved with all of the salient information being displayed. For additional assistance, please contact our support on 07 5555 0100 or email us at support at autoflow.com.